Who was on the phone? Our friends that accept shipments for us. We have a problem. It's snowing outside. Our trailer is buried in snow. We gotta be there like pronto. <laughs> so. <Yeah. laughs> You're dude. gonna have to get taller boots, dude. Bruh. Bruh. Like this, this is too deep. It's too deep, bruh. The answer, if you're asking, is that stuff heavy, is yes. <laughs> so, all right. All right, here we go. Ready? So it's a bit ironic that we're trying to go get a snow plow and our driveway needs plowed. I guess one last hoorah with the snow scoop. And this snow is the kind you want to plow, not scoop. How's it going down here? Uh, plowing funny. wet snow sucks. You kind of just have that like soggy look about you. You know, there's that chance that if the plow's the wrong color, we're gonna have to send it back. Should we tell them our devious plan yet or make them wait? I don't know. I think we should make them wait just a little bit. Just a little longer. Yeah, I think so too. Okay. Look for the huge boxes. What does a snow plow in a box look like? Hey, there it is. I see it. Hey. It's over there. Let me zoom in on this. It's over there. Mm, looks pretty big. Well, it's not that big. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize this was so big. All right, give them our gift. Our token of appreciation. Token Thank of appreciation appreciate it. has it's been awesome. received. So time to get this installed and plow the rest of our driveway today, right? Oh, I wish. We're still waiting on the hitch. Oh. I think oh. that should come tomorrow? I think tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. This might be our last time driving up a driveway that we plowed by hand. Is this where we leave the snow plow until we can proceed with the plan? Yes, okay. but I want to plow today. I know, right? So I guess we leave you guys hanging for a moment until the hitch arrives. All right, hitch is in the bag. What you working on? I'm on WikiHow, trying to figure out how to make a bow out of 10 yards of ribbon. Jesse the homemaker. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be on Pinterest, ladies! <laughs> We've decided to have a bow competition and compare Alyssa and I's bow making skills. Thing is, as a man, I'm risking a lot here. <laughs> because even if I win... You kinda lose. I sorta lose, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Can we do snowplow stuff yet? Yes. Yeah. Let's do it. That's it. First, we have to load the plow. Second, load the bows. We have to load the bows. I feel like this plan is getting really complicated. So what are you working on now? Jason's present. His pseudo present. His decoy present. His decoy. Yeah. <laughs> it's, all, it's all playing out in my head. I mean, it could totally backfire on me. Jason's already suspicious because this one's not good at keeping secrets. <laughs> I'm not keeping secrets. So Jason, so. if you're so good at surprises, what's in the box? Yeah, what's I want to know. It's a dish towel. An acorn. It's a walnut, sorry. There's something else in there. Ah. Oh. This is like those kid books that you have to open in the little bit. <laughs> and, and they look, if you oh, scratch it, There's it smells like, like evergreen. <laughs> Wait, I have to put shoes on? You have a snow plow. That's for you. Are you serious? That's amazing. <laughs> it's, yeah. <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> I say That's really cool. It's a full Meyer home plow. Yeah, it's a gorgeous. Yeah. So Jason, we have yes. one more task for you. Yes. You have to decide who made which bow and which oh, bow's yeah. better. Okay, yeah. I'm going. That one <laughs> looks better spatially. This one looks like an overachiever. I'm going Alyssa, Jesse. <laughs> Wrong! I, 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 I'm an opposite. I'm an opposite guess. A quick snowplow surprise turned into like 
eight hours of talking, whoops. So we're planning on heading back in the morning to test fit the hitch and do the install. God, it's slick out there. Yeah, it is. When Alyssa and I received the plow, we thought, you know, we do need a plow, it'd be nice to have one. But we're like, how can we make this plow produce more for more people? We want to both share and help other people, but we also receive the joy of giving. So it's it's a very much a win-win situation. Okay, you wanna put it in the fridge? I know. Cake! <laughs> Cheesecake. Mm, yummy. Hi, kids. There's a flat nut, maybe? So one nice thing about the home plow is that it's super easy to install as long as you can find a factory or aftermarket front class three two inch receiver hitch, which we scored for their truck. Uh, just look at our local auto parts store. And I think we picked this up for under $200. So, and it looks like it's a direct bolt on. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna make Kelsey try it out first. So, <laughs> see this do it right? again? Yeah. So, yeah. so go down. Wait, you're. Say hi. Hey. Yeah, do it right next Can you say Meyer? Meyer. Mm, that's pretty good. <laughs> say Meyer snowplow. <laughs> Alright, well, we can stop taking their day and they can go do something more productive. And wait for it to snow. <laughs> and wait for it to snow. And now on, we wait. Snow. Wow. Snowing it? Guess what we woke up to. Almost an entire foot of snow. And this pretty much only means one thing. Ambiance. Jesse wants to know if you were uh, having the urge to plow all the roads on the way here. I had a couple of times, like, I'm just gonna put it down. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> where you can actually film your dad. <laughs> Hold on to that with both hands. Yep. So this is the one steer? So, nice. Good. Jason just demolished the driveway in like one really? shot. Really? I missed yeah. it? Yeah. Oh, there's more than one shot. Jesse just crashed our drone. There were expletives. I couldn't tell which way I was going, so. <laughs> Got it. Didn't even break a prop that I know of. How does it look? This is heavy. Well, we've already been breaking all the drone rules anyway, so. So one very important feature uh -huh. to remember. Yeah. The off button. What happens when we don't press the off button, When Jason? you don't press the off button, you come back to your truck two days later to a dead battery. Yeah. How does Here. it feel? Looks too new. You, but no, but I mean, other than a few scratches, I mean, and I hit some things, I gotta admit, I hit some things pretty solid. Yeah, you cleaned up a year's worth of snow. Right. That's not one storm, that was no. the whole No, but that's what I mean, but that, you're realizing that, okay, great, the bank is too big. Well, okay. back up, bring it up a little bit, push the top over. I was watching yeah, your horse is. on that thing, and you're 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 getting the whole truck shimmying on that thing. So yeah. I mean, it's taking yeah. it's taking it, it, quite a pounding. Yeah. I feel like yeah, watching you with the controls too, they seem kind of spongy. Like yes. not precise. It's more yeah. like horse on it. Get it where you need to go, and, and then and go. And sometimes it felt like um, you had to be very purposeful. 
That truck yep. does look good with a plow on it. Sure does. <laughs> so how hard would you say this was to install compared with what you thought? If I would have just seen this as is, I would have thought I couldn't do it. Yeah. And yet it was really simplistic. And even thinking about this, it's some things you put it on and you're already dreading taking it back off. Mm -hmm. This, I already like, oh great, drop the wheels, take it off, bolt, 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 done. I Storage. can see that now, yeah. The trip board definitely works, I'm impressed. That was one of my biggest concerns. because So it's a, it's got a trip system on it, so that if you hit something with the lip, it doesn't damage the plow, it just flips the plow forward. This is a two spring system, and I think that's real similar to professional plows. They don't have one, they have two. And I think it matters because it helps even that force out. And I think the wired controller is nice. I, I, I know they offer a wireless version, but I just, in my brain, doesn't quite add up. For, and and that's know. that thing. You're not sitting in your home changing a TV channel. I mean, you, you're right. out plowing, it's cold, you're, working. you're getting it done. You, you, want a, you want something wired. I think that was probably at least a foot deep. Because I mean, when it, was, went down. Up, yeah. it uh -huh. was up to the top of my boot. Yeah. Thanks for coming, Squirt. <laughs> yeah. Did you see her flying the drone? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> So the real bummer about the whole snowplow thing is, it doesn't plow everything. No. You still got a shovel. Yeah. It's not in the advertisement. Yep. Yep. False advertising. Thanks again for your help, right, guys. Welcome. Bye, Bye, guys. Bye, guys. See you later. Now what? Do you ever feel like after the fun's over, it's like back to life, you know? It's like, woo! Oh, All wait. right. plow out a little spot right here by the door that'd be good yeah we probably need to dig out the truck too maybe our walking path and our walking path to the hot tub i think the snow plow really puts into perspective just how much snow it can move at once right and how much work it is to just scoop not done snowing yet and they're forecasting another five to seven inches in the next 48 hours so we may get more snow in three days than we've had all year just from this one storm so because they're gonna ask we might as well just do a quick update they want to know if the drone survived yes the answer is <laughs> yes didn't even damage a prop Somewhere in there. It's a wood pile. Look at this freaking snow. Hey, that right there looks like firewood. Well, I really don't want to come back in here tomorrow. Yeah.